Well, really happy. Yeah, really happy for the boys. Um, real test match, you know. So um, we haven't had a real test match for a number of years. So um, we're going to be obviously better for the experience. But you know, really pleased with the effort and the commitment and all those characteristics you want in, you want in your players in, in a footy team. And uh, I think we both teams displayed that tonight. I felt and um, both teams wanted to win. Um, <coughs> and you know, I think you know we did a little bit better than what they did. Pretty say a little test match because they. <laughs> it's, it's a test match footy, you know, so, you know, I've, I've been involved for a long, long time and it's a different game, you know, it's um, sometimes, you know, you, you don't get what you you want and with, with um, the way you play, it's a bit clunky at times, ball goes to the ground but penalties against you and all that sort of stuff, but you just keep have to keep on hanging in there because, um, you know, you, you need to do that to, to win the footy game, so um, I just felt that in my experience, that you know, was you know, one of the best test matches I've been involved with. Is that the kind of game that you needed heading into a final? Yeah, I agree with that. Yeah, I think uh, we can be better because of that. Um, we'll learn from that, obviously. But I just said to the players, you know, that's what you know, playing for us, you know, your country, um, you know, produces. You know, games like that where you know you've got to find that little little extra, you know, in, in your the way you play or effort levels that you know get you get you a victory. And it might it doesn't look pretty sometimes, you know. It's it's it is a little scrambling defence or you know dive on the ball or a big hit, you know that makes a difference to your footy side. Pretty ferocious pace up there. Yeah, definitely. It was. Um, I sort of had a an origin feel. Obviously not as fast, but just that end to end footy. Um, you know. We just had to dig deep for 80 minutes. So that was 80 minute game. We have we sort of had comfortable wins up up until this game. So. Yeah, as Mal said, that's a, that's a test match. We had to dig deep for it, and um, yeah, really really proud of the boys. That's the way we dug in there, especially that second half. Probably, probably didn't start how we wanted to, um, discipline and areas, but yeah, the way we fought back and uh, worked for each other in that second half was, was really pleasing. Can you lead a team into a World Cup final? How does that make you feel? Yeah, it's, it's exciting. Obviously, you just want to you know, get our recovery in and, and soak up, enjoy this win tonight. But yeah, we'll have a week's preparation just to recover and get ready for. For next week, watch the game with, with a lot of interest tomorrow and see who we got to play next week. But, um, yeah, as I said, we'll probably learn a lot from, from this game. We, as I said, we dug deep, but we definitely could have been better in, in some areas. So we'll, we'll take those lessons and uh, be ready for another tough challenge next week. How do you see that game going tomorrow? Um, oh, obviously, they, they played each other in the first game and tomorrow went, went up to their best. So I know they're going to come out and have a point to prove tomorrow, but... England have been playing some really good footy, so I think England will be tough to beat, but I know some are going to come out fine and have a, have a point to prove for sure. What was that atmosphere like? I mean, I feel like the, people, the, the locals maybe sided with New Zealand. Did you get a sense of that? <laughs> yeah, I felt shock, that. Yeah. Shock <laughs> yeah, we felt that. We, we, we're sort of used to that over here. We know everyone's going to be against us, so... Um, yeah, I'm sure we'll, and next week as well, we're reversing that they'll, they'll be <coughs> against us, so... We'll soak that up. We, we expect that. Yeah, we knew that. Obviously, I think they probably weren't happy with their performance last week against Fiji, and we knew they would come out fire and very passionate, obviously, uh, that first 15, 20, and, and, they, and they did that. We sort of had to weather the storm a bit, but we, we let them in you know, with a couple of, couple of errors, and our discipline wasn't great. So um, I think it'll be similar next week. It was, uh, you know, the start of the game was so uh, passionate, and um, yeah, we just got to sort of weather that a bit. And uh, we, we spoke about that most of our camp. We just work hard. We work hard for each other. A lot of our guys in our team play 80 minutes, and um, you know we've done that tonight. We worked hard for 80 minutes, and we got the win. Take us through that, that the whole Harker. That was pretty like a good intimidating for us. <laughs> they were in your faces, literally. Yeah, it was cool. Cool experience. <laughs> that's um, we knew we knew that's, that the Kiwis are very passionate, and that's what that's what fires them up for games. Doing that 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 Harker with a lot of passion. So yeah, we just soaked that up and. Get ready to play footy. Now, can I ask you about the Cameron Murray? You sort of you had that all in draw, seemed to let the team up a bit, and then that try in that second half. What did you make of the big leadership tonight? Um, I thought all our bench were quite quite good tonight. I think they lifted the tempo and um, the play played ball speed, and you know off the back of that, Harry was you know, very good as well, and allowed us to play a bit of footy. Um, you know, Cameron's a great player, and um, he's played his role. In the footy team, you know, to the best of his ability, and um, it's as seen by the, the try score, you know. So, um, really happy with 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 Cam and how the bench played tonight.
Mel, it's been part of Australian team's DNA for the last 35 years <coughs> to win in tight situations, particularly over here. Was it gratifying to see that tonight? From Absolutely, yeah, absolutely, and, and as Teddy mentioned before, you know, we we understand, you know, where we sit, um, you know, in the in the pecking order, and uh, we understand the way we need to play, you know, um, and um, and I think we've handled it really well, you know, we, as we said it, as we said at half time, we can't, we're not going to play victim to anything, you know, we'll make sure that we just get on with it and 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 uh, play the, the the style we want to play, and um, I thought, you know, tonight. Um, I think everything was okay at half time even though we were behind but you know we just kept on believing in what we we're doing and and um, eventually that that does work for us and that's what you know my experience tells us that you know if you just keep focused and keep on doing the things you want to do and um, you want to play the field position game like which it was a grind tonight and they played really well as well you know so we just had to had to outwork them and, and get to get into a position where we could score points well, we saw you and James Fisher Harris. You were pretty possessed in the second, second half. Did you, and then you went after him just after that. Can you tell us what was said and you know, how enjoyable that experience was? <laughs> yeah, yeah, I love playing against Fish. Um, <laughs> obviously, yeah, I looked up to him a fair bit at Panthers. And coming up against him, I knew it was going to be um, a real test and sort of just wanted to take it to him. And he enjoyed that as well. So, um, yeah, it was good out there. What were you saying to each other? Uh, no, nothing, nothing too serious. Just... I was mostly laughing more than anything, so it wasn't too bad. <laughs> Liam, I know it's hard to give yourself a, a rap, but um, how proud are you of your own performance? Oh, yeah, yeah. Pretty happy with it. Uh, yeah, just <laughs> trying, to do my, <laughs> trying to do my job for the team. and uh, Yeah, I feel like I did that. He did it very well. well. You did it very well. Oh, I mean, he's played truly footy over here, you know, so... Um, that's why he's in the, in the test team, you know, so he does make a difference. He makes great contributions to our team and, as, you know, he's obviously humble with things, but um, that's, what he, that's what he provides. And um, he's, he's played, you know, uh, really happy with uh, his performance, uh, not only tonight, but, you know, through the, through the whole tournament. Maybe that, that, the try that um, Josh scored, you know, the hard defence kick, we like, what was, was that, is that something you practised? No, <laughs> no, it's just what Foxy can do. Um, which is a, just a kick to the corner, and <coughs> Foxy's speed puts him in possession, positions that not many other players can be in. So, um, no, there's nothing real plan. I was just kicked to the corners, and, and Foxy was was in the right spot at the right time. Obviously, with his speed, so worked out well. We had to be at our best, you know. So we had to be at our best tonight, too. You know, we and as Teddy said, you know, there's a few, there's a bit of improvement, is, but New Zealand didn't really allow us to, to, at times to, you know, do what we want to do, you know, so, you know, full marks to them. So we're certainly improvements, but really happy with everyone, really, the, the effort, because you, you needed to, everyone needed to be committed, everyone needed to, you know, um, as I keep saying, need to come up with some special efforts um, through the through the game for us to be in a position we are. Now, we're figuring out to do a little clunky. Can you sort of assess your halves? And... I thought they were very good tonight, Ready? I thought they were... Ex extremely good, and um, you know, and I thought our kicking game um, has been the best on, best it has been throughout the, the tournament. I reckon so. Uh, really happy um, for the way they they performed. Um, you know, we, we gave we, we weren't good when we were down there, and we made a few errors. We gave away a few penalties, a few six agains, and things like that. We can improve in, but you know, I mean, that's rugby league too. So you expect those sort of things to happen. I thought we handled it really well when it did happen.